what was the one thing which surprised you in terms of where we are today versus you know was the clock back to 2024 august i would say uh, the efficacy of long reinforcement learning has been super surprising because about a year back or so many times people were also questioning whether do we even need uh, long reinfo- like you know any reinforcement learning uh, like people are talking about like do we need rlhf and techniques like this or can we just get by with standard supervised tuning uh, mm-hmm. fine tuning so give model a bunch of question answers and just run some sort of supervised fine tuning and that might be enough for it so but what happened was that rl came in and showed that if you can sort of you know think a lot over some problem if you you as in a model and then produce an answer and if that answer can be verified deterministically right that is mm-hmm. if a model can look at that answer and say that oh this is a right answer or this is a wrong answer which okay, is so a deterministic reward function which is very common in math or reasoning yeah. uh, or like you know other problems once they figured that out they sort of started to apply this long uh, reinforcement learning and they started to sort of just scale reinforcement learning more and more and the surprising part was that models kept on learning more and more 